Nearly missed the amber light. Here we go. Blake down. Time now is 12.18. You're waiting for your 12.22. Scott Rail Service from Edinburgh to Dunbar. Do not have the train code as I didn't copy the codes correctly. I'm very sorry about missing the amber light, but the button pressed correctly. So there we go. So this alarm's kind of squeaky and that one's kind of like rah, 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 kind of thing. It's got like that low tech, uh, low pitch. Uh, all four barriers do not panic. So yeah, crossing will be, uh, train will be from the flight, I think. There's the back lights there. So this crossing is uh, LED lights, I'm not sure what, uh, LED lights are from 2010 or 15, and there's the coast right there. So, uh, uh, check. I can't see much from this angle. I'm gonna cross it over to me. So, yes, yeah, the crossing's down. Um, I might have just got the LED light, but I might not have to have the correct transmission for it. Transmission. Might be able to get away from it on that side, but I don't know. So, yeah. I can keep it on this light, right here. I can just stand in and focus on this light, that's pretty cool. Because it's full of traffic coming from that way, as you can see. So yeah, this crossing is... There we go, uh, here it is. So another train following the cross country, because we saw that before this came. We've got... 3 to 3-2-1-1-1, and... We're staying for the next one! Okay, crap. I don't know what's coming. Uh, right. This is also for your... Okay. Next train is the 2 Yankee 22 uh, 1230 from Edinburgh to North Berwick. So, either that or something else. This could also be for a delayed virgin. Uh, one one zero oh seven. So those are the two that could be coming, but I'm not sure because I did not see. I saw one virgin going from the left, but that was um that was before. It's not that cold outside today as well. So I'll just keep it on here since we got a double stay first off. Um. So yeah, we got uh, delayed VTEC. Then uh, we'll be going for the. That was 12.32 from Edinburgh to Dunbar. Then we'll be having Edinburgh to North Berwick at 12.30. That could have been 12.28 though, I don't know. It's not coming from behind, so yeah, staying. Uh, this crossing is an MCB CCTV by the way, like that. So yeah, it's not an OD yet. It'll be upgraded soon though, probably. Uh, services that serve this crossing are VTEC, uh, Scott Rail, uh, Cross Country, and not Transpennine. They go on the West Coast Main Line. Uh, so yeah. Whew. It's windy today, but it's not that cold. So, yeah. Sorry for any shakes, guys. I'm trying to hold this as stupid as I can. Um, I might keep my left hand glove off for most of this. Climbing on to four minutes now. Uh, we'll probably be able to see the train come around that bend over there. Even though I didn't see it. Uh, if it is from behind there, it is a North Berwick train, but I don't know if that would... I don't know why they would stay for that. I mean, it's express at 12.30. Uh, times you use long Nidri real-time trains. Uh, screenshotted it on the 5, so I might not be accurate enough, but oh well. I don't have access on it, and I'm not using the iPhone 5 for the recording, that's not happening. So this is what I've got. This is what you'll get. So we'll see what this is, but I'm not 100% sure. Here we go. Oh, never mind, that's a bus. <laughs> that, was a, that was a bus. If this is a cross-country, then... Cross countries because 
someone in the car, I don't know if they'll put that clip in yet. I'm just not going to focus on the lights right now because I don't know. Once it goes up, then I'll be able to re, -in, re, re get myself to go there. Uh, nothing from the back. We've got five and a half minutes. <sighs> this is a Scott Rail, and it's 12:34. Malfunction staying down. I don't know why it'd be a malfunction. Though. Um, so either 12:34 to Yankee 01, uh, 12:32 Yankee 022, or this is one Echo 14. Which is a Virgin Train so to from wait no it's one Victor sixty two sorry wait that's a cross country one Sierra O seven that's my meant to say I'll turn this off for now I can focus it as well like that uh, clock in six minutes now already. Oh, we're not. I uh, hope we're not malfunctioned. We shouldn't be, unless the uh, people have put it off. Um. You gonna go up, or is this? It's not my fault. There's a light there. Um. She's coming yet? My God. <laughs> Seven minute closure already. We haven't even this. We haven't even been here before. Seven minutes to start it off. It might be a quad stay if this doesn't chop chop. Yeah, the next train's supposed to be at 1228. It's 1224. So I don't know if we're staying for that train. Because it's not coming that fast. And the if the Virgin's late, then that means that. That means that would delay the trains behind it. But yep, it is the Virgin. Here we go. We have got an electric set. This is one Sierra 07 from London King's Cross to Edinburgh Waverley. We have got... It's going fast as well. Here we go. I just saw it around that bend. Here we go. 9111! I don't know what livery that was. 82229 with 91111. Uh, and... We're triple saying. Clocking it. Yes! Holy crap! Okay, we're staying. I'm just gonna focus on the lights right here. Right, we're staying. I'm focusing on the lights. Holy crap. That's... Right, we're staying for the Scott Rails. Okay, wow. Like, even King's Now is not as bad as this. Jeez. I'll definitely be coming from the left then. Like, I'm not the reason it's staying because I'm not gonna push it. Right. Um, so that was the 107, so that's pass. So we're staying for your 1229 to Yankee 22 from Edinburgh to North Berwick. That's a Scott Rail. Then we'll be staying again for another train, so we might be clocking 10 minutes for this one. Oh gosh. Then I'm gonna find myself a space to put. The schedule is so massive today. Like, I've never seen more than a triple stick. Uh, I've never seen more than triple saver. This is probably gonna be a quad. Oh my god, oh my god. So yeah. Uh, what the frit? That's a Scott Rail. Here we go. That is it. Yep, Scott Rail slow. Twelve twenty nine. So, here we go. No, it's not going slow. Never mind. We've got three eighty one oh nine. 318.109 and will we go up? Up they go! Nine minutes in! Man! That was long! Wow! That's a loud alarm! Right, time now is 12.32 and you're waiting for your 
Uh, yeah. So 34 to Yankee 01, Scott Rail Service from North Berwick to Edinburgh and possibly for your 1241 Echo 15, Virgin Trains East Coast Service from Aberdeen to London King's Cross. And also possibly for your 1241, 6 Sierra 45, um, freight uh, Alcan service from North Blythe to Fort William. So we might be seeing a triple or not. I don't know though. So yeah, that's what's coming. But I'll focus on this place. So we'll be waiting for a 380 as well as a, uh, 380 as well as a VTEC from the left. Uh, VTEC's expected at 12.40. Wait, am I looking at the wrong times? I better not be looking at 11.40. No, I'm not. I'm looking at the correct times. Okay. So, next for... Yeah. Yeah, that train's expected to arrive at 12.34, so we're down for Berwick. And we're also down for the VTEC. I can tell you that. Oh, these alarms always make you jump when it goes down, but I finally caught the amber this time. I did catch the amber last closure, but I'll have to review that. Um, I might miss the next closure for the for the uh, next train if the Alkins don't come past, uh, because I need to pee and then I'll need. I'm not, I will need to pee. I'm not peeing myself here. There's floodlights up there as well. That's great. Yeah, this, this crossing is probably the most active I've seen. It's more active than Lincoln's here. Lincolnshire crossings. Um, like Brayford and stuff. I'm going to go over here see what's happening. Anything yet? No. I will probably just keep you on this side right there. Sorry for the wind, guys. It's really windy today. Looking out for the VTEC, but I don't see it yet. It's really unique that this crossing has like the four, the four lights. Is it coming here? No. So yeah, the last one was actually a special uh, VTEC locomotive. It was 91111. Uh, so you guys will have to tell me. I'll, I'll have to look at that in the comments. I'll have to screenshot that for the thumbnail. That was pretty cool. We saw that. Right, I'm just gonna keep looking this way now. Since the train's here. One handed, so if any shapes, and I apologize. Oh, here we go. 381015. 381015, three car. And up they go. We're not, we're not staying. And that was it. Literally just got done peeing. Here we go. Down we go again. Right, I didn't catch the amber there because I had to pee. Right, time now is um, time now is 12:38, and you're waiting for your 12:40. Um, 12:40, one echo 15. Uh, Virgin Trains East Coast Service from Aberdeen to London Kings Cross, and possibly for your six year 45, 12:41 and a half uh, uh, from North Blythe Alcon to Fort William. So that'll be coming. For, I think the Alcon will come. Right, oh my god, okay, I do not have my gloves on right now, so it might shake, but those are the two that are coming. And if it stays after the VTEC, then we will be seeing that. Well, I'll check it again. Oh my god, okay, so lucky I got that there. I literally just got done peeing, and then had to get the, and then the crossing started going off. Uh, it does have a four second amber light timer, but I didn't get it, as you guys saw. So yeah. Uh, today's one of the red news where I Really, really mild, but not windy, but not cold. Windy, but cold, I meant, whatever I'm talking about. Uh, by the way, this train will be at 43, and there's a dash up there, so they're playing. Oh my god, my 
flat, my hat's literally flapping in the wind. Oh, I was going to fall into the tracks. That'd just, that'd just be bad. Because then a train would run over the hat and slice it. Because this is my special one. This is my hat. And I like it really much. Oh my god. Oh, there's my car right there. Okay. Uh, this this bar is 04050, so 10, 20, uh, 2000, I think. It's from the 4th of the 5th of 2000 or 5th of the 4th 2000, so April or May 2000. These barriers were into service. Oh. Focus out the lights. After this, I might get my gloves back, but it's probably Is that something over there? No. Crap. Sorry, it's good. Focus on the lights and focus out the lights like that. And hold the camera like that. There we go. This video won't be the best, but it's 60 FPS and it's still really Uh, that's a lorry. Probably just gonna keep looking out for the VTEC. Actually, you know what? Uh, since the VTEC's first, I'm just gonna focus on this lights. Once I can. Okay, focus there. Oh my god, okay. Stop shaking. There we go. It's moderately better. Total 41 VTEC's not passed. Now can we come from the right? Right, let's uh, go back here since the train's supposed to be coming. Right, it's past Long Nidri. Uh, we do not have a live update, so it could have been cancelled, but uh, yeah. If you do see an Alcon, that'd be good. Even if it's a light engine, then I'll still be happy because we might see a new 66, so it might be 77. Because those are the ones we saw. Uh, I don't see anything from the right there. Uh, here comes the VTEC. It's a 43. Right, if we do stay the next for the Alcons, but we have got. And up they go, we're not seeing the Alcans, crap. And we still stayed uh, up, and we still were for four minutes. Literally oh. started it and stopped it. Down we go. side of things now and uh, not casting the amber lights. Time now is 10.56, uh, no, freaking 12.52, waiting for you 12.54. Um, once here away from uh, Sierra 35, uh, cross country service from the Bristol Temple meets to Glasgow. So that's going to be coming from the left first, as I didn't read it correctly. So I might have a double stay for the train to go to the right. So I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. The train will be coming from the left. We might stay for the right, but we might not. Uh, we'll, pro we'll probably go up for like maybe two minutes. Go back down again. Depends how the cross country is doing. I need to get the gloves. There's the lights there. I didn't have. I didn't cut. I didn't put the passes because they're like too close. So yeah. I just focus on. Oh, not doing that side. Uh, warning: Do not trespass on the 
I've always been on tea for doing that is a thousand pounds of death. Because let's face it, you can get killed in a second. In America, if you were trespassing and the train saw you, they would stop. They just run you over. Here we go. Two to one. I shouldn't have taken my gloves off, it's because the wind's been chilling them. Right, here we go. We've got... Um... 1-1-3-3. and... We're staying for the Berwick. We're staying for your 12.55 at 1 Sierra 08 and staying for your 2 Yankee 02 uh, Scott Russell's from Edmonton North Berwick. Staying. Long new to use about maybe one or two minutes away from here, so that's uh, one. Not accurate enough, but yeah. And it's not like one of them sleep well, so it's like, The train's coming from the right, so I'll just stand it. As they do. So, oh, but he's on the tracks. No, he's not, Ben. Wow, wow, wow. It goes up. Yeah, this crossing gets frequent double stays as well, so it's just packed, I'll tell you. And then you've also got a 13 or 2 from North Berwick to Edinburgh, so that, if that stays as well... So this might be a quadruple stay, or it might go up for a small, short, short interval. Because if it does, then I'm running across getting my gloves. Where is that train for the left now? There's a VTEC actually coming from the uh, VTEC. We'll have this fast Scott Rail and then it will probably go up. We'll probably go up in Scott Rail when we head to Hell to Let Traffic go through. And also, a uh, Fox Lake is somewhere uh, down the way, towards that way. Well, it might be that way, I'm not sure. Uh, there's a car, uh, no train yet. So, we probably can't even. Either way, I was one of I'll make sure to turn the Yeah, this crossing doesn't get much traffic uh, because it's only for a private road. Here we go, Virgin already! Five minutes! Uh, VTEC! Uh, we'll be staying for North Berwick, which will be coming from the right, so we're having a triple again. 91! Here we go. Look, guys, got a dash cam. We've got 91107! Train! 91107 to 8224, and here comes the other one. Burnt tail lights on the left. Right, another one. We've got. Perfect. This one's going a bit slower. 3102! Oh, 012! 12 my mistake, and up they go. Bam, son, that was awesome. Right, I'm across before this crossing goes. Got it, yes, here we go. Time now is 1300, you're waiting for your 1303 to Yankee 21, Scott Rail Service from North Berwick to Edinburgh Waverley. LED lights, light, lights work fine, but I wouldn't be surprised if they upgraded this crossing to SBX barrier soon. I don't know, guys. What they could either do is replace all these barriers with SBXs, or just, uh, or just get one of their long SBXs that go all the way across the road. That would work too. So yeah, I believe. 
Um, all except one I've been messing up with the amber light, but I've gotten it, but it's like a short flash. So I don't know yet. Uh, when I'm editing, I'll see. And then one of them was across country, which was from the car. I still don't know if I want to put that in yet. And then we'll be staying for it, and then uh, we won't be staying for this closure, so I'll go quickly get my gloves. Oh, train should just be arriving in the station now. For the 03 expected 02. As it is 1303, this has got rail service to somewhere. No. There's the lights up there. I'm actually just going to keep focusing this. And if anything comes from the left, I'll go. And the three men of the that comes to buy, then that'll be, that'll be 6S45. 6S452 Fort William, so... Yeah, 6S45 would go to the left, because it's going to Fort William, North Blythe. But I don't know why they always timetable the freights to come through here. So, yeah. I've been doing good with holding the camera stably, with both of my hands, without gloves on. But I'll be getting them on next, because my hands are getting cold. Yeah, this crossing is known for getting long stays. Also guys, uh, hopefully this year I'll be able to visit Morrisdale Level Crossing again and this time have real time trains on. Because that crossing is actually not too far from Cheltenham Spa, so I'll be able to get like, oh, cross countries to Exeter and stuff. And it will go down a lot. It's like this this crossing's like Morrisdale a bit, except it's by a busy road. And it's not in Cheltenham. I'm going to keep from there, stay in. I like this crossing, I do. It's just when it's windy. But Scotland's one of the windiest countries in the world, so yeah. What the heck? Yeah, the train will just be coming from there. Uh, yeah, you, you could probably use Preston Pans as well for times, but I don't know. 1304. Right, train arrived at 02, so it should be coming right around now. It might come at 05, though. Um, and if it does come at 05, it'll probably stay for the two versions that are behind it. So we might have two more trains, because we've only seen like six closures, and I mean like three closures, and yet. So this barrier is 94053. 94053. Oh, yeah, and here's the barrier. I definitely used some halogen. I know this crossing was a halogen uh, back, back until it had the same barriers. I, I don't know when. I know it was at. Oh, here it comes to the train, it's 380. Uh, this crossing did have halogen boom lights as well as halogen wig work, and then they got obviously moved to energy like rain and level crossing. If you saw that video, right? Here comes the train. Just rounded that bend right there, real for my rating. Here we go. Here we go. There's your 109. There's your 109, and will we go up? Up they go. That's not it, so we'll see you guys once it goes back down. Also, just wanted to point out a small issue with the crossing is that that barrier skirt does not fold. Just notice that right now. Uh, we're going to be seeing our next train in just a minute. Uh, I don't know when it comes though, because I do not have the actual train screenshot in. Because I've got a stopper at 11.30, and then I've, but before that I've got the echo, and then I've got something in between that, so... I don't know what the next one is, so I'll look it up back later so you'll see it on the text. Got it, yes. Oh, down we go. Right. Time now is 13.15 and this train will be anonymous due to the fact that it's not screenshotted as the next train screenshotted on my phone is the 11.30 which stops at Longwood Road. So yeah, that's what I've got. And time now is 13.15. 
I was 13, 16, so we'll be seeing this, this train, which will probably be a cross country, then we'll be off. So yeah, this is the last closure, which is pretty cool. Uh, I've filmed a lot of trains. Um, some of them might not be in due to the fact that the amber light was not caught because I had to go to the car. So, yeah. I'm trying to film with two hands here. That's not really working, so. Uh, now what? Frick it, I'll put it down. Oh, look, a free iPhone 5. Um, I don't know that works, no. Double homes. Right, so I do not know what is coming, I do not know. I will make sure to put it in correctly with the times, as this is just after the Virgin Trains East Coast, so just know that if if it is a VTEC then then it'll probably be from Inverness or something like to Aberdeen, but I don't know. Some new shoes and some stuff. So yeah, comment down below next location. Uh, if you do want me to get a Mark 11 as well, that's an AHB apparently. So yeah, might go to that. Don't know. Right, I don't know where it's coming from, but we just had two v two v sets on the right and left. We we just had two v sets in both directions, so you know that could be the it could be the case for either side. How busy is it today? My goodness. I'll focus on every light except that one. Uh, the lights uh, are uni part rail LED wig wags. So that's what we've got here. Um, they don't need to be replaced because they were upgraded from halogens just like every single freaking crossing in the entire world. Uh, nah. Uh, mine head still needs to be upgraded. Uh, upgraded to LEDs. It's got SPX barriers though. Um, from 2009, it was upgraded from grey halogens to LEDs, uh, not LEDs, to uh, better halogens where they didn't they didn't put on hal uh, LED lights. No. Anything on the right? No. Here we go. Cross country. I knew it. Um, might be one Victor 67 if it, if that's the return train because we've been here long enough. If it's 133, then this is six, 1 Victor 68, or 67. We've got 2 to 1, 1 to 9! 2 to 1, 1 to 9, and... We're staying for the next one. Which is not the stopper, so it's obviously a train before that. Could be the Alkins, could not. I'll make sure to put both of them on the text. And if I don't find them, then I'll just put... Oh, this is 2 to 1, 1 to 9. <laughs> yeah. Well, now King's now's doing that crossing is fine. Kirk Newton's also fine. There's no problems there apart from issues. Then this crossing's obviously fine as well. Let me get the stuff. And as you can see, there's the distance between the ground. So I'm gonna come across. Right there. Right, back down and the blinds and the lights. Next crossing we go to, uh, since this one has a bad view, then I do check it. But, oh, here we go. one again, and up they go. 381 from North Berwick, or Dunbar. That's going to conclude St. Germans for us today. If you did enjoy the video, then please leave a like. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more, please smash the subscribe button too. And uh, once again, uh, thanks for watching, and peace out.